Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm bringing you a Sun at least deck guide. Before we get to that, firstly, if you're interested in coaching, um, I have a Discord and a Twitter down below. DM me on one of those and you know, we can set you up a time. It's going to be $10 an hour and if it's your first time, you get one hour free. Um, I'm coaching like about three people a week right now. It's not, not a lot, but um, it's pretty good and I really enjoy seeing all of your improvements. So it's, it's super cool. And yeah. Um, just hit me up. Also, I'm streaming all. If you want to catch any of these games like live, I'm streaming. Push off TV slash Acer Box. Drop me a follow. If you want to see me play your decks as well, I'm doing deck requests for free pretty much every day. Just and I, I play in Masters ranked. So if you want to see if your deck's good, if you just want to see me play like a cool fun deck, then yeah, definitely f drop a follow on the Twitch. Link down below and just yeah. Um, Drop a follow and hopefully you're there when I'm live. I can post the, the link, your deck code. And also if you enjoy the content, please like, comment, subscribe. And yeah, really helps. Let's get into the deck guide. So basically, um, this is Sun Elise Control with Lord Bro Bro um, Bromine, Bromine as a top end and Ledros as well. And um, the basics of this deck the idea is this is just a hard control deck. It, it's actually like pretty good into a aggro. So you run your opponent out of resources and you finish them off with Ledros or you like it's a big attack. Or yeah, they just have no resources pretty much to kill you. First you have uh, two Gohard. This is one of your finishers, um, for those who don't know. Uh, Gohard, when you play three, transform to two, pack your bags. And pack your bags basically deals five to the whole board. It's basically a board wipe. And it, you know, does 5 to the enemy nexus as well. Go hard's really good in this deck. And it's really nice to We'll explain why later. Raven Bloom. Uh, this deck runs like a lot of pings. So all your pings are going to suddenly do 2, which is nice. And yeah, it's just it's just really nice um, additional removal. And you pretty much keep one of these every mulligan if you can. Flox just, it's in every Noxus control deck. Wait, what can I say? Death Lotus is really good with Raven Bloom because it makes everything D2, and it's also really good with Lord Broadmain because of his effect. Um, for those who don't know, his effect reads deal to, to deal to, to an enemy. Your fast spells, slow spells, and skills have when I damage a stunned or damage enemy, kill it. So, and basically, if everything is damaged, it kills everything, or it applies damage so you can kill everything um, later with Death Lotus, right? Super, super key in this deck, and it's honestly a really good card. Uh, Disintegrate's really good with Go Hard, Foul Feast, etc. If you're just a solid 2 mana um, setup of Vengeance, so like 4 mana Vengeance if you add Foul Feast, Death Lotus, etc. 3 mana if you add Go Hard. It's just honestly a really broken combo. <laughs> At least, um, a lot of people run this deck with Kindred. And I chose to run Elise because you can level her as a winning con. It's, I mean, it's not normally what you do, but it, it's doable. And also, I think the Kindred version like loses to aggro too hard. This version, it beats aggro quite heavily, actually. Like, if you have Elise, it, it just really helps you in the early game. And generating the free spiders, honestly, really good into control as well. So, yeah, Kindred's honestly not necessary in this type of list, especially when you have stuff like Senna. So I prefer the Elise version, but if you want, you can go ahead and run the Kindred version. It's up to you. We have Glimpse for draw. We have Spell Slinger to enable Flock. And also, if there's stun for some reason, it probably won't be because you don't really have stuns in this deck. And you deal too, but you normally use this for the stun to enable Flock and to survive an extra turn. Unspeakable Horror to generate Nightfall cards. It's also an extra ping for Disintegrates and Lord Brown main and stuff like that. Scorched Earth is basically any damage unit dies and it also kills landmarks, so yeah, more removal. Catalog is why Go Hard's really good in this deck. Because um it basically if you play only one spell, you can ensure that catalog creates a fleeting copy of that spell, so it's not like completely random. And then if you play a Go Hard, basically you get another Go Hard and you create more Go Hards in your deck, it's easier to get to pack your bags and yeah, that's basically what catalog is for in this deck. 
it, but you can also create more glimpses, more whispered words, stuff, and anything you want. Catalog just a really good value engine. It's just really bad into aggro, <laughs> but otherwise, it's it's pretty much infinite value, right? Whispered words is really good. Uh, it's just uh, alternative draw to glimpse. Yeah. Senna is just she's just a really good as a control because not she she makes your go hard fast first of all, right? This is insane. Go hard fast. One mana drain drain one honestly really good. Of course with um Tibolk comes a one mo one mana drain two right, and she's really really easy to level up. If you, like, I think every game I draw Senna, like out of all the games I draw Senna, like seven of the out of ten times she levels up. That that is like an insane ratio, and yeah she's just she's just really easy to level. When you level, all all your Fast fast spells get minus one pretty much. You're, you're damaging and killing kill spells like fast spells. So like one mana, one mana, zero mana, zero mana. It, it's just really insane. She's just really good in this deck, and she also creates darkness, which is just not good. It's, it's not that great, but it's removal. It's removal. It's expensive removal, but it's removal. It is what it is. Why else really good because it pigs everything. If you like will into Death Lotus, oftentimes it kills everything. Especially if you have, if you have Brahmin on board, it guarantees kills everything. And it's really good um, with Tybalt because, you know, just an AoE deal too. Brahmin, we kind of discussed this card. And Lidros is a finisher. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for the deck. Mulligan wise, you want your early game. You can keep. I don't recommend keeping Catalog because. Catalog's really bad, and if you double draw it, it's like kind of clunky. You can keep Senna in like control matchups. You can keep this in control matchups sometimes, but I often recommend just mulligating for Elise and Raven Bloom, and that's kind of it. Um, every, maybe Go Hard. Go Hard. You keep Catalog maybe if you have Go Hard, and it's like every it's a control deck, so it's matchup dependent. So you're gonna want to like. Keep Vile Feast depending on the matchup if you think it's it's worth it. Like if they have um a, like Legion Saboteur, if it's an aggro deck, you, you keep Vile Feast. Um yeah. You can keep Flock if you have Spell Singer, it's just yeah. It's really combo dependent, really matchup dependent on Mulligan and that's pretty much it. So let's get into the games. Once again, so echoes the waiting. Nope, 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 nope. Um, this deck is kind of like slightly aggro, right? It's not like aggro, but it can output a lot of damage really fast. Haven't I been here before? Mm. Okay. Quickly. Ceiling is kind of annoying. A bit. Go hard's good. Not into that, but I mean. I could start go harding now, but I'm fine. I guess the best go hard target is the cat. Oh, I guess we will start go harding. Now that's a good uh. This is for Zon. New tech wow, already leveled. Day, new Zon. I guess if I want to prevent the strike. We'll do Death Lotus Vile Feast. Pass. Okay. 
They're just trying to stall here, honestly. I could pass. That is an option. There's always an option. I'm gonna pass. You're not really threatening that much damage. Okay, I'm just gonna kill the Zillion. Because it's annoying. Actually, might as well sing with this. He's just dying. Ah, we could try glimpse this. I don't know if they'll let a shot, but we'll see. Hmm. Ah, that sucks for us. Fox's pretty good. He can kill the zillion or an echo if he plays it. We must tell our story. Or that. Let's That's pretty important to, to die to kill. The bite doesn't hurt, but the venom sure does. Fang's turn. Go ahead and block this already. Man, I'm good. Wow, he actually attacks with it. What do you think, Fang? I think that's a mistake because now the Zillion's not gonna level. Oh no, I guess it will now. <laughs> okay, maybe it wasn't a mistake. Stings. Mm, we're gonna do this just to get it damaged so we can kill it next turn. Just as I have always known it would be. Yeah. This temple kind of slaps. And we can fuck this earlier. Wow, he just tanked seven. He might have second zillion or third zillion, I mean. That sucks. Or that. Which doesn't save it. He forgot about the Tibble. Ah, uh, Tibble's great. Fine. I'll drop this. Say I got a life with. Yeah. Uh, let's just start throwing this out. Things aren't gonna improve themselves. Hmm. Sure. Well, you had a future. I know we don't get an extra darkness, but this way we can, you know, push damage. Right. At least threaten it. Threaten the lethal. Nice! I might keep this file piece. I think it's fine. I think it's a fine keep. Yeah, with certain hands, we can actually level at least in this deck. It's kind of disgusting. Yeah, we'll just play this. Um, so I play Elise down. I 
Pull the strings. You won't suffer long. Okay. So he doesn't have Oxon in hand, there's no way. Okay. Wow, that's really good for us. We just open attack. Hush now. Wow, uh, really awkward hand. We even get to drop catalog. And if he plays like Eye of the Dragon or something, or that, rules to know good from bad. we just do this, level the Elise, and we get another one next turn too. To buy off these team again. Oh, he's gonna try um get him health, I guess. I don't know, it might be a bit late though. Yeah, we got a, a spider that doesn't go through, but it's fine. Smooth as silk. We don't need the spider, we just have to kill this. The spirit gives to those who listen. Like, we just go for it, it's a free card. He buffs it with shape stone, we go for it again. Okay, I'm gonna glimpse. Okay, it's a free glimpse. Because we're getting an another spider, right? And he shouldn't have anything that can interrupt it. That's fine, we have second at least. That's scary though, Challenger Auction. Oh look, I have my challengers back. Oh, there you go. Yeah, we can go ahead and do this. Or we can do this. No, 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 no. I want to kill this. And then the others don't don't even get to block. The reason why I'm doing this is because I don't want this to proc if possible. Yeah. Never mind it proc. I tried. But the auction dies at least. And we denied the life kill too. Wow. So the least it might be a problem. Honestly, we have like this plus flock. Actually, this is gonna give oh shielding. Yeah. So in this proc, then we're in a bit of trouble. It's fine. Nah, it's a little bit greedy. It's a little bit greedy. Well, we full swing because we need board space. Scum, your lesson begins. Let's see. I'm okay with this. We have a whale. Like we have like so many pigs in this deck. I know they do have like tell stones now, so they can heal the eye. The world within. I don't mind if they do, honestly. Huh. Guess I'm the big guns now. As the dragon will. Okay, we have to kill that. 
Like we have to get rid of that ASAP. Force is meaningless without skill. A pleasure to see you. This master. is two plus the five. I mean, he could do the barrier thing, I guess. But. Uh, so he is getting the barrier down. That indeed does suck. But forcing out the Telstones is good, in my opinion. Trick. Uh... Oh, he's looking for Overwhelm. There's a spell shield. Well, if he doesn't get overwhelmed, we're kind of chilling. Like, we're actually chilling, though. Like, no overwhelm? Oh, okay, but he doesn't have enough for the absolver. Strike firm, prepare yourself. Sure. Sure. Darkness and light. We easily tank this. Okay. I just want to pop the spell shield, man. Also, he already barriered, so what if we just, like, like, that's in the barrier, or pop the barrier and then, like, block. Actually, it doesn't work, we can't do that. I'm just gonna table. Our enemies cannot hide. Oh, he's doing this for Dragon Links. I'm gonna block this. Is I don't really want to deal with two dragon links. Or we can just wail the dragon links. Actually. Scores to settle, crooks to kill. You know how it is. Yeah, I might need the double swap. Nah, we'll just swap this. Maybe I got the free flop. I fight with my spirit, not my fist. Alright, whatever. Our enemies would be foolish to underestimate you. Mm. I'm gonna start with this. You know the thing is, you might have second Lisa, but it's okay. We have so much that can kill him this turn. Let's start with this. You gonna give him barrier? No. Dragon. Hmm. I'm not gonna swing with the dragon or the spiders. Maybe I should. We can just wail to get rid of this. The dragon binds us. Well, in general, just pushes a lot of damage here. Let's see. Oh, not that much damage anymore. Hmm. Wait, that's kind of funny. That doesn't work. 
I'm gonna do this. Just to draw. Like, who knows, we might get a horror right? for next turn. Just to threaten lethal. Because he could still lethal us if he has, like, second least in and some insane hand, I think. We can kill this always, so. We can always kill that. Okay, this instant proc is just funny. Oh, he just have to. Good game. Um, this is kind of a slow deck. But I don't think I keep catalog still. It's kind of dumb. Maybe if I had um go hard, I would keep keep a catalog. I know what lurks in the shadows. Skitter out from the darkness. Ramping. I'm gonna glimpse. Because I kind of want the draw here. So young. Okay. Hush this is a ramp deck. Maybe I should have uh, kept catalog for sure. I could just catalog this turn and get infinite value. Yeah, we're just gonna go hard. Have you met my pets? Oh, I'm killing that. Uh, we're gonna use the nightfall actually. Disintegrate is so good into Brahms. It's so dumb. I just think he gets the Poro first. Ooh, I do want to Raven Boom this turn. Okay. Probably violence with block. You know, let's play this as a block. <laughs> like, he does not want to attack now. There's no way. Oh, he actually did. But why though? It, this bar is just dead now. I don't understand. Push it. Lord Bromine. Could play this, could play Senna. Okay. What if I open attack? Genius open attack. He kills my Elise, which I don't care about. We get our Lord Brodmane down. My Death Lotus kills this. Noxians are not the monsters they make us out to be. Our Death Lotus now kills this, this. We get Valfi's this if we really want to, that's not really necessary.
second. Okay, also Senna. Senna's good. Senna's great here. Long road behind. Honestly, Long he just cares really ahead. well. We have the darkness. Does he even know you're on death mode? I don't think he does. But you can't attack. Getting dark. Like ever. Is that all? Ooh, 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 ooh. Big death loaded. No heals. Oh my gosh, it's the set of level up. Darkness and light. This is so big. And we have the Timok. Keep your distance. The storm approaches. Sure. Darkness and light. Look, I know he's gonna kill my Senna. No, you're not. Wait, this buff doesn't work, buddy. Oh, flash freeze? Or in Steam, flash freeze. Alright. Well, he can't thunder. That doesn't transform. We get to get our second rogue main down. I'm okay with this. I'm definitely okay with it. Because our rogue main kills this. Or we could just chum block this too. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised this doesn't like this table doesn't buff this two three, but it doesn't matter. Ionia misconstrues our noble intentions. Kind of also Ledros, I mean, we could just jump block that, but it's fine. The Entombing? Bro. Okay. This is just a game, right? This is just good games. Yeah, alright. Alright guys, that's it. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.